morning guys it is way early it's about 5 30 just setting up for wilson ways this morning the only car in the lot is my car the little electric car it's actually pretty cool but within a short period of time cars will start to roll in and until then i'm having my coffee For a car that's not electric, it sure is quiet. It's supposed to be to be 12. What's up, Johnny? Fireball, thank you once again for giving me a place to come to. <laughs> Have a good time. Uh, John Hotchkiss, how are you, man? Hey, how cool is this, it man? Is, Fireball, cool. Tim, and Malibu, and cool cars, and you know, great it, people. It doesn't get any better. Uh, no. We throw in some coffee, we throw in some Hot Wheels, which are coming, by the way. Yes. And we have a good time. What's going on with you, man? Oh, we've been so busy and so run up to SEMA, so oh, yeah. you know what that's like. Yes. You know, we're just, just pounding the pavement, getting Crazy. everything done, and, and uh, we have new products to display. So you, need, you need anybody to come in and lift stuff? <laughs> we always Grab do. Wes. Uh, yeah, we'd like to get, we'd get Wes back just for a moment. But uh, where can where can people go to see your stuff, your awesome stuff? Oh, that's easy. It's Hotchkiss.net. H-O-T-C-H-K-I-S.net. Check it out. And uh, you know this guy. We'll see you at the show. The show without the Grafman. This place is grooving, man. It's got the music. It's got the people. Smiling faces. Cool cars. And another beautiful day in Malibu. this month's wheels and waves incredible cars some really fun people look at this beast right here look at that
you're probably wondering what I think is one of the coolest parts. Yes. What you been asking? I, I've been asking that the whole time. Well, let me let me show you. Right here, we have the Chevy Bolt. Now you're thinking Bolt. They named this after the, the runner uh, Usain Bolt. No, this is the Insane Bolt because the other guy he runs, but he runs out of gas. This will never run out of gas. good time really good turnout uh, we're gonna go and try to find the Dow's and head over to the vintage trailer show uh, which is just a little ways up PCH we'll see how it goes but there's still cars in the parking lot here that are kind of cool check this out good thing to do after a car show when it's so freaking hot out here it's suddenly like a little bit of a heat wave head to the beach jump in the water so about maybe 20 minutes on the beach at the most two really big bags full of trash but this is Halloween you never know what you're gonna find like a little skeleton sandal for my collection I like it Some turnout for wheels and waves uh, maybe about a hundred cars but what really makes this show unique is that it is the people you know I mean you, there's lots of cars and coffee things out there lots of shows all over the place and and the people are great and the cars are certainly cool but here at Wheels and Waves here in Malibu we get a very not only eclectic mix of cars some really bitching cars that you guys just saw but also some really interesting people Tony Dow Paul Moyer they didn't know each other so for the first time they got a chance to meet at this show and they spent the entire show like like two hours talking to each other and then they went and had breakfast I know a lot of people who, who don't give themselves permission to go and do the, the things that they want to do you know, I'm not saying you, know, you should drop your job and you should you know blow things off and just go have fun all the time now, there's people that do that but they're not going to benefit from the hard work that you do as well but what I am saying 
the point I'm trying to get across is that you, you gotta make time for yourself. You gotta, you gotta make time for the things that you love because you know, and we say this on the vlog quite frequently, that what you put your, your mind on, what you focus on, expands, it grows, it gets bigger. But you gotta get that. You, you really gotta, you gotta believe that. You gotta understand that if you're really into, into something, um, maybe something that you've built, something that you've done, you would see that that same process, you know, that, that you gotta start the dynamo, you know, God helps those that help themselves. You know, what does that mean? If you're into God, you know, and, and you're into the, the whole God thing, then that's cool, you know, you, you can use that, it doesn't matter. If you're into the, the universe or, or universal energy or passion or, or whatever it is, it doesn't really matter. It, none of these terms matter. What you call it doesn't matter. Just to know that it's there. You can call it chutzpah. I don't care what you call it. You can call it a hot dog. It doesn't really matter. When you recognize that there is a, a, a form of energy that exists in the world and in the universe, and it's available to us at any time, but you gotta start the dynamo yourself. You gotta, you gotta start the, the, the machine rolling first. You know, it's not gonna step in and help you and pave the way and give you a bunch of money and do a bunch of things for you unless you start the whole thing yourself. And you gotta, you gotta make that happen. And that requires you to know what you want and infuse a tremendous amount of passion, excitement, and love, love, L-O-B-E, love into that thing that you want. And if you'll do that, then things will come. The universe will start to hand you things and say, hey, is this what you want? Oh, is this cool? Yeah, maybe how about this? And amazing things. Amazing things will happen. Things out of the blue. Things that will, will, you know, will just show up, you know, randomly. Like you go to the beach and you find a treasure, like this. I just found this on the beach. Uh, Santa, we always write, find the right foot. I don't know what that's about. What is that about? But I have a collection of these sandals from the beach, and they end up on the wall in the garage. And we have this whole wall that's plastered with all these sandals. This is a treasure. You know, to me, trash is treasure. But it's Halloween, and 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 we found a perfect Halloween sandal. That's about it. Ladies and germs, um, I, I, I enjoy so much hanging out with you guys and, and you guys hanging out with me as we go and we do these automotive adventures and these, these beach life adventures. We got a lot of stuff that's coming up this week. Uh, we're heading up to the Murphy tomorrow to do a really cool event. We're gonna be uh, hooking up with Mark Sterenberger and with uh, David Neal. You guys know Mark, a uh, big car designer, super talented individual. At the end of the week on Saturday is the big uh, George Barris Memorial Rally. I'm gonna be taking you guys on that. I mean, that's gonna be freaking awesome. We're gonna drive the entire rally, we're gonna see a bunch of cool cars, amazing people. And then on Sunday, I'm one of the judges for the Art Center Car Classic. If you've never been to that show, you gotta go check it out. But if you're in another state, or if you're in another universe, then all you gotta do is watch the vlog, and you're golden. Hey, people, that's it. Give love, that's where it's at. If you want your life to improve in any way, I don't care if it's something right over here, or if it's something right down here, or maybe up there, I don't really care where it is. If you want your life to grow, and expand, all you gotta do is keep giving love. Keep giving it over and over and over. Just do it. Love you guys, stick with me here on the vlog. We're creating amazing stuff. Be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, join us. This is Fireball Malibu Vlog, the automotive adventure. And nobody, nobody does it.